During the 1967 Six-Day War in the Middle East, Israel managed to capture quite a few Soviet T-54 and T-55 main battle tanks. There was demand for more tanks than they could purchase at that time, so they decided to adapt these tanks for IDF use. Initially the modifications were simple. They replaced things like the radio, machine guns, jerry can racks, and other storage parts. But eventually they decided to replace the Soviet 100mm main gun with an M68 105mm gun. This allowed them to not have to worry about using captured ammunition, and also upgraded the gun to one with higher combat effectiveness. A swing mount for the central machine gun, 60mm mortar mount on the commander's cupola, and a remotely operated 12.7mm machine gun on the top of the gun mantlet were also added. A stowage box on the right side of the turret was added, which helped identify the tank from its Soviet counterparts. Overall, the tank performed very well during the Yom Kippur War of 1973. The tank stayed in service until the early 1980s, some being sold and others were converted into the Ejerit Heavy APCs.